Police are questioning dozens of tow truck operators on the Gold Coast in an operation to weed out more bikies. But the police commissioner has also been targeted, with detectives investigating an apparent threat against him. At dawn, emergency teams assessed a suspicious envelope containing white powder. It was addressed to the police commissioner. The envelope was discovered in the x-ray room and examination room, so those two persons inside were secure in that room. While intent was malicious, the contents were harmless, but police aren't taking any chances in the light of the crackdown on bikies. It certainly is a lot of inconvenience, but I'd rather be safe and uh, secure than uh, the possibility of something going wrong. Until now, that crackdown has focused on clubhouses and tattoo parlours. Now towing companies are in the firing line. We're seeing cars taken from the streets, sometimes unlawfully, and exorbitant amounts charged for the return of these cars to the owners. Detectives are going through the books of more than 90 towing operators on the Gold Coast. We also plead with anybody who may have had their car unlawfully removed uh, by a tow truck operator and had to pay an exorbitant amount for the release of the car to come forward to the police. So far in the crackdown, 184 bikey members and associates have been charged with about 360 offences. All Queenslanders can simply sleep safely in their bed knowing uh, that uh, these criminal elements are off our streets. In that time, police have conducted more than 4,000 vehicle checks. They're also collecting a database of tattoos on suspects. Josh Bavis, ABC News.